<clears throat> Hello, ladies and gentlemen, girls and boys, and dudes of all teenagers, as well as the uh, gals. My name is Christian Chandler. I am here, and y'all are there. <laughs> this message is for everyone of the present and the future beyond this date, February 24th, 2007. My birthday, my 25th birthday. I am high functioning autistic. And in my 25 years, I have seen and learned so much. And today, I am shared, intended to share some wise words that I hope each and every one of you will take to heart and allow for yourself and everyone else a better prior future. You should avoid at all costs smoking, drinking alcohol, and intaking similar icky, dangerous stuff. If I could, I would take every last ounce of tobacco, put them on a rocket, and shoot them up to the moon. And I haven't done either one, and look at me now, I'm a fizz and fiddle, and I'm living 25, hoping to live on to be about 80 to 100. And y'all, hopefully y'all will get a chance to get up to that ripe old age as well. Now, among the better things you should definitely try before despising, is some of the hobbies of those of your own opposite gender. If you're a young gentleman, I recommend buying yourself a My Little Pony figure of your favorite color, or whatever. Now, for the uh, ladies, I recommend a good old Autobot from Transformers. Well, with the uh, Autobots, well, it's a vehicle where you can, you can drive down that imaginary fast lane. So, while few people may ridicule you, you should not worry about it. This is how angry I am. Because they, it won't matter. It won't matter because... Also keep in mind that while you're playing with these things, you should keep in mind of what your true original gender is. Young man, young lady, stay straight. You know, girl for boy, boy for girl. Not just for me, not for the big man upstairs, not for your family, but do it for uh, yourself and for, and for the benefits of everyone in the future. And besides, if you stray away from the straight path, it can really jeopardize the entire future of the world and the human race. Ladies, gentlemen, girls and ladies, don't just go over Gaga over the handsome rich boys. You should take into consideration all the other gentlemen that uh, you may have considered that may be less attractive or equally, less or moderately. Please stay straight. I'll leave you with those words as I have shared with you on this, my 25th birthday, February 24th, 2007. I am Christopher Christian Weston Chandler. Live long and shine on in your very own unique way. Thank you very much and have a wonderful day. AP Station. My name is Christian Chandler. I live in Bucksville, Virginia. I have a PSP. I like to rap. I play with the rapper. I go with you now. The only song I know is Master Onion, which I got from a demo I bought from my friend Megan. I have the PSP and she don't. So give me the PSP. I rap the rapper so I can give one to her. And then we can play together. So here we go. We're gonna sing it now. It's all in the mind. If you wanna test me, I'll show you find the things I'll teach you. Be sure to be jump. Nevertheless, to get a lesson from teacher, now kick, kick, punch, punch, jump, tap, block, block. Once more, now kick, kick, punch, punch, jump, jump, and block. Yeah, 
how angry I am at Adam Stackhouse, Apraluski, Rudell, and Surya Butchwald. They should have been disqualified because they had music and more than one person in their Freakazoid videos. Hello, my name is Christian Weston Chandler. It has come to my attention that I have a lot more fans of my electronic, electric hedgehog Pokemon Sanchu than I had originally thought. Everybody, else, everybody has a life, so do I. I have a life. And I have a lot of people who may have picked up on the wrong theories of my person, but I would like to humbly apologize 
for appearing to be some kind of sleaze. Please understand, I am a 25-year-old high-functioning autistic male, a father of a sweet little pretty girl who I will dub the name Crystal Weston Chandler. And it's also similar to the illustrious Meadows. We have, uh, we have been traced down to Daniel Weston, who was on the May Mayflower Voyage. And uh, beyond him, Anne Boleyn, who was the, uh, one of Henry VIII's, King Henry VIII's wives, who gave birth to uh, Queen Elizabeth I. We have the uh, Cherokee blood. I'm one sixteen. 16. Okay. And from among the Cherokees, there are very few of us left because we were big in number, but then came along the uh, force march on the Trail of Tears, where some of us went into hiding. Yeah, short line there, Cherokees, for a respected tribe, which my mother is 66 currently, and my father is currently 80. They both just turned that way in the last couple of months. They were so nice of them for them to give me the uh, birth during the early 1980s. I was diagnosed with high functional autism and I lived a uh, somewhat rough life. Some of the teachers and principals of Nathaniel Green Elementary School, they abused me, they abused me by pinning me to the ground with uh, their hand, with uh, holding my wrists and my ankles, pinning me down the ground and, and audio taping my cries and shouts. And my mother and my father, they both fought the court system. But anyway, we eventually moved to Jessica County for a nice fair school system. Sonic Chu was first thought up in my senior year and along with the uh, nice bunch of teachers backing me up in my circle of gal pals. I attended Piedmont Virginia Community College and eventually I graduated from there too with a degree in computer a drafting and design also known as CAD CAM. And uh, during my high school years I was used to being surrounded by girls and after having to uh, leave them I felt ever so lonesome. It became hard for me to approach approach the girls like I used to. I never have stopped anybody. Never have stopped. All I did was sit around with a sign by my side that said I was looking for a boyfriend free girl, 1825, yada yada yada. I have feared rejection and the infinitely high boyfriend factor because you cannot tell which ladies are paired up and which are not. I do not move from my seat at all, unless I need to go use the restroom. That's it. Because that's all I'm doing there. I'll just wait for a girl to come talk to me, because... Like I said, I'm afraid to approach him. So please understand, I am not a violent person. I'm decent. I come from a caring, loving pair of parents. I'm kind, I'm considerate, I will respect your space and your feelings ever so much. I apologize for my MySpace profile if it appears to reflect anything on the contrary of all that. I apologize that I appear to be a slow-minded person. Such feel as they have created uh, demeaning web pages. All I ask, all I ask, are those people who are watching this right now, is just take them down, please. I'm asking, as an innocent victim of misunderstanding, just take down your web pages. As a band who has suffered like most everybody in this world that we all live in. Thank you very much for your time and listening. And please remember, I'm an innocent person. Please understand that. Thank you again. Take care.